Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Excuse the nightmare mess. Um, it's been crazy. But this video is um, a little tribute to Gailene. Um, She recently lost one of her dogs and it's very sad. And I think her daughter lost her two dogs too. So it's been like crazy for her I'm sure um you know dogs are part of our families as well and it's very sad um it's very sad when we're, they're not with us anymore so a bunch of us friends got together and we made videos or we just did Instagram pictures so I'll link everything in the description box below um I've got I I've got everyone's picture um coming up next Mine is the last, and I'll show you how I created it. It is, was crazy getting this video together, let me tell you. Um, I was out of town when I heard about it, and I didn't have my nail polish with me. So I, came, I got in town late last night, and I videotaped, <laughs> I videotaped this video, and then I'm having phone issues the entire time, all day. So I actually had to go out and get a new phone and wow. <laughs> so none of the apps are just like quite the same. So it was a real challenge getting this video done. I still have one more to go. <laughs> um, anyway, so it's really late. I'm very tired, but I hope you um, all enjoy this video and I hope Gailene likes it too. Um, so let's get started. First, I'm going to apply my Wave Gel Base Coat. Then I'm going to use Wave Gel's Clean Slate and Strawberry Shortcake. I have um, two coats of Strawberry Shortcake and two coats of Clean Slate. And I'm going to put a top coat over so I can do the stamping on this. And I'll be right back. I'm going to use Wave Gel's shiny no clean top coat now on the black nails I'm going to put one pink heart gem before I cure it okay so now I'm going to cure everything and um, come back and we'll do the stamping I'm going to use um, this little plate that I got off of eBay. And I'm going to use my Moira stamping polish for this little dog right here. And for this little um, paw print, I'm going to use my Bundle Monster Electric Pink. For the stamping, I'm going to use my MoU London Stamper and Scraper. So first let's get this little dog right here. So I have the puppy image right there, and I'm going to place it right on my fingernail. 
right here. Ooh, there we go. Okay, now we're gonna get the little paw prints. So I have my little paw print right there, and I'm going to put one right here. There we go. Okay, I'm going to do a couple more. And I'm going to add these to my thumb. This will be the last one. And we'll put it right here. Okay. There we go. Uh, kind of snazz up or jazz up <laughs> the um, stamping. And I'm going to use Kira Sky, but I'm going to use the um, Soak Off Gel. I just wanted to show you what this looks like. They describe it as a kind of a hollow um, pink, but I don't think it shifts that many different colors, just more like of a, a pink, maybe a purple, but it's pretty, so I'm going to use it. I forgot to tell you, it's called VI Pink, and I put a little bit of it on the tin foil right here, and basically what I'm going to do is take some dotting tools and I am going to dip them in the pink, the VI pink, and then I'm just going to put them on top of the paw prints to make them nice and glittery. So here's the finished look. I know Gailene's favorite color is blue, but um, Tinkerbell was a girl, so I wanted pink. <laughs> and I chose this little image because I thought it reminded me of Tinkerbell. So I hope Gailene, Gailene, I hope you like this. Um, if you, if everybody likes this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.